Mo money, mo problems. No money, mo problems. Talking minimum wage at the Toasted Owl. First off, we want to talk about the minimum wage law. And there's a couple of different components. As you all know, we've got a state component that passed, and then we've got a city of Flagstaff that passed. I think everybody in town knows that it's a really hard place to live. Um, and so they voted to get a raise, and justly so, you know, they deserve it. I just don't know how many people understood that both of them were going to happen, and both of them were going to happen so quickly. And um, so that's when we started Elevate Flagstaff to try and figure out a way where we might be able to slow the second proposition down a little bit. We still have to hit that January one ten dollars an hour, but as of July 1st when this kicks in, we now have to be two dollars higher than the state minimum posted minimum wage. All of us are concerned about losing our local businesses. It's easier for the Chili's and Applebee's etc because they can spread their costs around. I'm nervous. There's a lot of fear and angst as business owners consider the ramifications of that um, passing. There's um, obviously going to be price hikes across the city that decrease the spending power of a lot of individuals who are not getting a wage increase. I saw a general excitement from most of the community members. People are going to be really happy with those extra dollars in their pockets every month. If one more corporate giant does not come to town because our minimum wage is high, my heart will not bleed, sir. To only consider those couple business owners that might be hurting is, I don't think, very um, empathetic of them. Someone who works full time, even if that means they're flipping burgers, who no matter what you do, if you work 40 hours a week, you should be able to survive in this town. I hope that it gets amended. I hope that we get enough signatures. We need 4,000, apparently, um, and slow this down a little bit so that um, businesses can keep up and consumer spending will adjust accordingly. But if it doesn't get amended, I know there are a lot of places that aren't going to make it. Mo money, more problems, or no money, no problems? That's a good one. <laughs> you should have mo money and you should have no problems. That should always be the goal. That's the goal. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yes.